Hi guys, I just wanted to talk about something very random. Um, also, I'm having this really weird feeling. Uh, I can't explain it. It kind of just feels like my whole body or brain is like overrun with something. I can't explain it. It's like every little thing I do or everything I touch or every noise I hear and everything I like even me talking right now, it feels like everything is amplified and every like my senses are going fucking nuts right now. And I don't know what it is. I haven't had this type of panic attack or feeling in a while. Like it sounds like, like I'm not talking loud at all right now, but it sounds like I'm screaming in my head. So normally when this happens, I try to calm down and I try to just listen to my voice or just focus on what's happening right now. Like I can feel the desk. I can feel like my legs. I can feel everything. So I know that like I'm awake and I'm real. <laughs> um, so I guess I'm having, uh, it's passing now that I'm talking about it and just touching things and it's definitely passing. Um, yeah, and the loudness is going away. I don't know what that is. It's like overly sensitive to sound or my, my senses were kind of overwhelmed with things. I don't know. But let's just talk about what I was going to talk about today, which is this happened to me maybe two years ago, three years ago. Um, and it was this kind of the scariest thing that's ever happened. And I've never really had anything like this happen to me before. And it's it was just very new. I'm just very, just different. Like shit you see on TV, kind of different. I have hiccups again, God damn it. But, okay. So it started when I was like going to bed. I was like reading a book. My lights were off and everything like that. And my TV was on. I was watching a scary movie, or I think I was watching either Spongebob or a scary movie. I can't remember. It's probably Spongebob. It was around like 3 in the morning. This was at my old apartment um, when I had a TV in my room. Um, so, like, I'm reading, and all of a sudden, the screen goes dark. So it was Spongebob. I'm remembering it now. Um, the screen goes dark, so I'm like, oh, maybe it's a... It's a commercial for a scary movie. So I look up, because there wasn't, my TV wasn't up loud, so I couldn't really, like, hear anything or see anything. Why is my camera doing that? It's like having its own heartbeat. Girl, stop. Um, <clears throat> it's still doing it. I don't know what's happening. Anyways, I look up at it, and... I swear to God, it looked like my room was on the TV. Like, there was a camera where my bed was, and it's like, it took a picture of, like, it was like hiding under my covers or something, and it took a picture of my TV, like, in the corner of the room. I saw the edge of my bed, and I saw my window, and it just looked exactly like my room. It looked like it was, um, <clears throat> excuse me, it looked like it was taken hours before I had went to bed. And when I went to go in to look at it closer, it stopped. It, it went straight to like an old lady commercial or an old person commercial. Why is my camera acting like it has a fucking heartbeat? Knock it the fuck. Girl, you need to stop. What is happening? It's happening every time I talk. That's really weird. Um, why is that happening? That's really fucking weird. My camera never does that. Um, let's just ignore that. I don't know what's happening. Like, it even looks like my, it looks like my, my, my light is doing it in the back. But it's, it's not doing that. Oh my god, that's really creepy. I'm gonna continue talking now. Um, it stopped now that I started talking about it. That's fucking weird. Oh, no, it's back. Um, so... 
I go up and I look at it and an old person commercial comes on. And the reason why I knew it was my room that was on the TV is because my TV back then had a bunch of stickers on it because I'm a weird person and I put stickers on things. Like if you would see my old laptop, my whole laptop is covered in like fairly odd parents or fairly god parents. Girl, that show's not on anymore. That's why I can't remember the name. Um, fairly, very, fairly god parents or odd parents or whatever the fuck it's called. Um, stickers all over my laptop. So like there was stickers, the stickers that were exactly on my TV, uh, that was on the TV that looked like it was like a picture or something. It like it was in the picture, and even the the thing that my TV was on was in there too because it was a green uh, dresser thing that I painted a while ago. Uh, I painted, duh, it was a while ago. It was like three years ago. So I painted it and it was green. It was the exact setup on the TV. I'm not even kidding. Okay, this like heartbeat dark, dark light, dark light thing is starting to piss me off. I don't know what's happening. I'm sorry. Literally, it looks like my lights are dimming and they're not, I hope. They're not. They're not doing that. Um, so I went to go talk to my mom and it was definitely three years ago or four years ago because my mom was alive then. So, uh, I went to go talk to my mom and I told her what was happening that like I was watching TV and, uh, all of a sudden the TV goes a little dark and I look up and my, my, t my whole room was on the TV. I'm not even kidding. And she said, well, maybe you were like half asleep and you, you just, now it's completely dark on my face. Conspiracy, the devil doesn't want me to say this. Just kidding. Um, no, but she said, maybe I was half asleep. Maybe like, maybe it was nothing. It was, it was just like, it was, you were imagining it. It's basically what she said. So I just, um, I went I left and I went to my brother and I, I told him what had happened and he's like, oh my gosh, I just read something like this on Tumblr that this girl, it happened to her too, but it was like of her on her laptop and, and, uh, like it was like right, like at the same time that she was actually in the room. So it was like someone took a picture of her that moment. So, um, and it was on Tumblr and I read the story myself and it was somewhat like mine because the picture that was on the TV, it looked like there was a camera hidden, like under my covers, kind of, on my bed. And I saw my bed because my bed had like pink stripes on it. And that was my bed. Like it was literally my bed. And it looked like it was taken from my bed, facing my TV, that corner of my room. I saw the blinds. I saw everything that was in my room. And it was just extremely fucking weird. And like, I don't know what that was. I don't understand what it meant. Like, what the fuck? Like, was there a fucking alien probe in my bed? Um, are there cockroaches with cameras? Not to say that I had cockroaches at that apartment. I'm just saying I know there were spiders. Why the fuck are there so many fucking spiders around me? Um, maybe it was a spider, you know, casing out the joint for his friends. Um... Maybe it was the Illuminati. Like, they fucking interested in my ass. Girl, no, bye. Like, what the fuck was that? I don't know. Like, aliens? Alien? Like, not even aliens would be interested in me. Like, what the fuck? Like, why is it doing that? I'm gonna do this. Can you fix yourself? I don't know what's happening with my camera today. It is becoming a asshole penis, so. There we go. Fix the light. It was the lighting. Hopefully that's what that was because it literally looked like my lights were flashing off and on or like dimming randomly. And my camera never done that before. Um, or maybe you never seen it. You're not going to see that part. Maybe it's just my, it's dark again. And my camera never does this. So maybe fucking the Illuminati's like, oh girl, you're not supposed to tell this story. Whatever. But yeah, it was really weird. I've never had that happen to me before. So that, oh, my light's doing it again. Um, so, I don't know what, and it's not, okay, see, I have an autofocus on my camera, and the autofocus thing is not moving. 
That's my lights doing that in the background. What the fuck? Okay, anyways. I don't know what that was. I don't understand what that camera, what it was. Like, it literally looked like my room on the TV. But every detail was right. So this is, that's what prompted me to get rid of my TV and get rid of that dresser. So when I, so back then, I, that was when I never, I did not have a TV in my room anymore after that. Like, no more. Bye-bye. Um, because it scared the living shit out of me. Like, I don't want to say that again. I'm just going to ignore that fucking light thing because it's really starting to bother me. And it's not scaring me. It's just a little creepy that that's what it's doing. Because the autofocus thing is not moving. So it's not the camera autofocusing. It's the, um, the lights. But the lights on back there are not doing anything. It's just doing it on the camera. That's fucking creepy. I've never a fucking seen that before. Wow. Okay. Well, you know, I've been hearing a lot of shit lately. I've been seeing a lot of shit lately. Um, today I heard, I heard like a crow outside. I looked outside. Um, I randomly saw this tall black stick figure motherfucker like running, running away, like really super quick. Uh, this happened like maybe 20 minutes ago. So I don't know what's happening. <laughs> a lot of paranormal shit has been happening around me lately and it's really starting to bother me. Lights, what are you doing? Stop. Stop. It's not going to stop. Maybe I can ask the ghost. I'm going to ask the ghost to make it to stop. Fucking pulsing the lights. Oh. Oh my god. It just stopped. What the fuck? Do it again, bitch. Or can you please make the lights do that one more time? Maybe I scared it away. I think I scared the demon away. Okay. Well. Bye. Um. Yeah. That's, that's, the, that's doing it again. Um, or it stopped. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what fucking, what the fuck. Um, but if you guys can know anything of this or you've had anything like this happen to you guys, let me know down below because, like, it's really creepy. Also, I'm going to do a live stream later tonight after I'm done fixing my hair. Um, so that's going to be fun. So, yeah. Thumbs just up, subscribe, you really don't have to, but I really appreciate it, and I will talk to you guys later, hopefully. Bye.